Hey everyone, and welcome back to Nuclear Throne. I think it's time for Rogue Day. What's today's daily for? The 16th. It's for the 16th. Let's do it. This is going to be difficult. Rogue is a tough character for me now. Didn't used to be. She's she's pretty strong. And she spawns with, like, one of the best bullet weapons in the game. Very controlled bursts with, you know, potentially low ammo consumption. Which is nice. Alright. See how this goes. So, rather than rad canisters, she gets, uh, airstrikes. Uh, I'm gonna ditch it. So, those airstrikes allow you to destroy terrain, kill some enemies, and the stuff you'd expect from an airstrike. And if you get thrown butt, they become absolutely insane, which is fun. So the thing about Rogue is that she's always chased by IDPD. They're all about killing you at all times. Gotcha. And uh, that's, that's inconvenient, I might say. Second Stomach is probably our smartest call double healing from many sources. <clears throat> Alright. No! I hate shielders. Shielders are my nemeses. Uh, her second passive, by the way, she has two passives. One being being chased by IDPD. The other, Max Portal Strikes Hype is that she explodes when she gets hit into a small IDPD explosion. But I don't think it's been buffed, and it's really, really bad. It's super weak, practically useless, and it makes me sad. So I'm going to take Throne Butt over those other things, because Throne Butt makes it absolutely absurd how large your portal strikes are. Like, literally just kill an entire huge area of stuff. It's awesome. Alright, nice. So I want to be using at least one per level, basically, as long as I can figure that I'll get the canister, which I usually do. Of course, I can use the uh, airstrike, the portal strike. Alright, nice. I got some... Ooh, heavy crossbow. Don't mind if I do. I got a rad canister, that's not normal. Why did that happen? I don't know what's up with that. Alright, so you get more rads from... those dudes. Move. Okay, see, everything's fine now. I just had to make sure that, you know what, you're gonna get an airstrike. You can kill yourself with your portal strike, by the way, so... I would recommend against such a strategy as to do that. Usually killing yourself is a pretty bad plan. In my opinion, I don't always know what I'm talking about. I'm liking this whole I haven't gotten hit yet thing. This is good. That's not everyone apparently. And there's like no portal strike ammo. Why is there no portal strike ammo? Did I destroy it? That wouldn't make much sense to me, but it's the- Oh god! I, w I hadn't gotten hit until then, and then I just got hit like twice. For six total damage. Really bad. I'm gonna have to go with Bloodlust here. Chance to heal uh, whenever you kill an enemy. How did that hit me? I'm actually confused that that hitbox isn't possibly that large. That should have been safe. Oh well. That's my daily. I didn't even check what rank I was because it was obviously a worthless run. That was my daily. I was really, I was liking how that went until I just got shot twice for no good reason because that was just not good. Other than that though, everything was great. Why do you do this? Oh, you're doing this to yourself. You made a huge mistake here. Boom, see, I told you, huge mistake.
All right. Nope. So again, you can be really efficient with the rogue rifle, or you can be really inefficient. It goes both ways. Oh, show. But I like it. Alright, both of you can die. No one will mind. Finally killed that, dude. I really liked my mutations there, that was the thing. I wanted to keep those in my life. Scarier face instead of, uh, <laughs> boiling veins, because 20% less enemy health sounds awesome, and not dying to my own portal strike sounds lame. That's really all there is to it. Seemed like that was a relatively, um, aggressive spawn of IDPD, number-wise. No, the f oh, the ammo. Back muscle, though, that's nice. I didn't have that last time. I also didn't have scarier face. Back muscle means we can hold more ammo at max for all weapon types. Alright, this is good. Dude, it feels like the rogue rifle's a little stronger than it should be right now. Which I guess I, I don't think is a bad thing. Alright. Everybody dead. Except the IDPD that spawn at the end of the level. Which is moderately scary. Alright, we out. Peace. Okay. Oh gosh darn it. Scary. Alright, we should be fine now. Good. Everything went better than expected. Okay. Good. Not good. Good. I love when that works. This is the dream. You know what? Screw them. Good. I'm glad I deflected that successfully. So the energy sword is like super sweet. I was really scared that wasn't going to work out for me. I don't get enough energy swords in my life though, so that's pretty nice to find. Rhino skin for four more max HP. Very nice. I don't know how you didn't die. Oh, I failed in my singular goal. He revealed to me his singular purpose. I thought I was the chosen one. I didn't think I had a message to deliver, though. Maybe a warning. Thanks. I don't even know that I can really get good use out of this portal strike. Because it just means I'm going to lose my... I don't know, I'll portal strike him. Alright, he lived. That's okay. I'm accepting of this. Rogue, why you gotta be so tough? Alright, we optimized our portal strike there. You get two. Excuse me, something else lived? Oh. Cool guy, huh? Alright, so we didn't level up. Which, uh, is most unfortunate. I probably should have gone for, um... Oh, that could have gone badly. Probably should have gone for... Oh god. Okay. Okay. That's a regular flame shotgun. I might be interested anyway, to be honest with you. That sounds kind of interesting. Boiling veins is pretty nice. Immunity to fire and explosions at uh, 4 health and below. I 
I didn't get anything that made it like really worth keeping the rogue rifle. It's a good weapon. But if you're not building for it, it's not going to be the carry that you want it to be. It can. It can absolutely be the carry. You can use it for the whole game. But I didn't uh, I didn't make that happen. Auto crossbow sounds pretty sweet. Sweet. I like this combo that I've got going here. Strong spirit. I'm going to need to take strong spirit. You can't die unless you're already at one health when you get hit. So, that's awesome. Even if I'm at two health and get hit by a crystal for 20 damage, I'll take one damage. It'll be great. Ooh, that was a close one. I like how this is treating me, though. I don't really need to portal strike anyone right now. So let's portal strike them. What I don't like, oh dear. Ah, oh, barely. Buster launcher, heavy slugger. Can't say I'm too excited about either one. That should have deflected directly into that dude's face. Face? Face and he should have died. What I don't like about the auto crossbow is its lack of perfect accuracy. I don't know how that missed, dog. They need to have a chat. Alright, thanks. Uh, oh, that was such a good predictive shot, too. It was just slightly off. Ah, barely missed. I'm trying to make sure not to activate this, though it would probably be to my advantage to pick up a crown. Like, I don't see the downside, honestly, since I'm already getting chased by IDPD. It doesn't seem like it matters much. I already had Max. Come on, what are you? Blood launcher. That's not a bad thing. Oh, boy. It's not going to charge. Should have just activated it right away. Seriously would have been a smart plan. Bloodlust goes really well with um, Strong Spirit. Because that pretty much means that you just won't die. Except in this situation. But see, it just gave me one health back and now I can instantly just start taking damage again. And it won't even matter. Because as long as I don't get to one health and then get hit, I'm fine. Like I said, it's a really great synergy. And yes, I intentionally juked his uh, his car throw. That was actually planned. Okay. Don't mind me, dudes. Laser minigun. It's tempting. It really is, but it's not what I need here. Two laser miniguns. Why aren't I steroids right now? Tell me that. Can you? No, you can't. Answer is probably because I was very recently steroids. Alright, so we do have boiling veins. Which means the dumbest of deaths are, at the very least, pretty much avoided already. And again, that's a pretty dumb way to get hit. Just keep swinging. I love that I'm max HP just because of this. Alright, I'm, I'm mostly... Heavy crossbow is like real tempting. I'm gonna have to pass though. Second stomach. Ah, oh, there's a racing line too. Second stomach would be really clutch. Um for many things. Hey guys. I love you guys too. You're all great. 
I like to greet my friends by throwing grenades at them. Because really, what kind of friend are you if you can't survive a grenade? That's like 100% your worth as a friend. Whether or not you can survive the grenade that I randomly threw at you when I saw you. I don't have many friends, I'm not sure if I mentioned that. Alright. Hmm. Not a bad thing, but not what I need. I don't think that uh, I'm going to have an okay time against the throne, though. I think the throne's probably... Oh, I had to dodge, too. The throne is probably going to murder me. It won't even be a mystery. It'll just be a murder, not even, you know? All right, my ammo is counting. Nope, hate you. Auto grenade shotgun. My explosives are pretty high up right now. Let's do it, yo. I have, like, it's comparably decent ammo. Note I haven't been using portal strikes. Mostly because I... Oh, fine. Uh, don't have thrown button. Really all there is to it, and all it takes. Alrighty then. Not bad. Lightning rifle, not great, but like, the fact that I get, uh, ammo from it means that I got a lot of ammo I have full stuff. Uh, by the way, the portal strike does, in fact, destroy enemy shots, which is pretty nice. So I can use it for that if it's getting really bad in this fight. It's actually, I think, it's best use. All right. Enjoy yourselves, grenades. All right, I don't want them to get back too much, because that doesn't really help me if they're exploding before they get to the boss. I clicked out of the game. Oh, no. Okay, we're fine. Dude. Calm down. Thanks, buddy. That was intense. They're probably actually IDPD here to kill me, by the way. Oh, maybe not. They just wanted to be there to kill me. I'll take throne button. Alright, I don't have very much of this. Oh, that was close. Should have died. I didn't, though. Boom. Okay. I won't complain. Oops, almost killed myself. But then I had the boiling veins. Go away. I don't actually know why they all just died there. I have no clue what could have caused that. But it was cool. Am I right? Am I right? Auto grenade shotgun seems pretty good. Hey, we level crown now. Enemies can drop portal strike ammo or super blast armor. I want to know what super blast armor is because I haven't had this. Is this like super boiling veins? My my veins are boiling so hot that I'm immune to explosions completely. No, okay, because my my passive is blast armor. I guess I didn't even know that. So when I get hit now, I explode, like, all over the place. It's incredibly disgusting. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, that's actually super cool. So explosions just fly out and kill everything. For having 
Boiling veins, my ammo is really, or not boiling veins, back muscle, my ammo is not doing well. This is actually a really cool mutation, and like, it synergizes really well with my build right now. Oh, okay. Where what I've got going is, um, the whole strong spirit and, um, oh god. Strong spirit with uh, bloodlust. So it's just like that kills something and instantly I'm back up to enough health to survive another hit. You can probably almost play the game purely on those two things together. Ooh, that hurt. Don't do that. Ultra shotgun. I can't say no to the ultra shotgun, I'm sorry. It's too good. Auto grenade shotgun's pretty nice too, but we've got an ultra revolver and an ultra shotgun. Sorry, not ultra, heavy revolver and ultra shotgun. Both of which very, very good. Yo. So ultra weapons of course use your radiation in order to shoot as well as ammo. Which means they're gonna be limited limited time uh, offers, basically. Oh dear. I mean, you did kill yourself by doing that. It wasn't the best of plans, but like, Consider me struck by surprise. Alright, what? Oh, ultra shotgun, right. Dude, check out my beastly fire rate with this thing. I'm not dead. <laughs> I was gonna say the dude's making a mistake by being alive right now. But really, I was just almost dead. For, for attempting to kill it. And yes, the ball guy mama is now a dude. Oh, I wanted that. I'm like not doing so hot for ammo and such. All right, so I need to not constantly use radiation to shoot things. I do have the ability to shoot weapons that don't use my radiation. Oh, I really need the plasma minigun. That's like my next goal in life, is to find that thing. This is a little intimidating. Super flat cannon, that sounds pretty silly. Really, you don't die to that. That would have hurt if that had been bounced back at me to kill me. I'd probably have been eliminated from existence. Later, dude. Let's take a laser cannon now. We're just running around swapping weapons like it's our job. This is the this is not the third level because this isn't a possible third level layout, but like how is this not the third level with Big Dog already? I like that level took me two levels worth of aging and strife or something. I don't like this weapon a lot. I do like this weapon a lot, though. Is that a hyper launcher? That's a hyper launcher. I hope that came through with me. Yeah, it did. Good job, buddy. So the hyper launcher has, like, immense impact damage. And then, you know, is an explosion as well. Immense being 25, I believe. It's like totally stupid how much damage output you have with the Hyper Launcher. Dude, calm down. Shoots two explosives and it kills Big Dog that fast. Ow. That was hurt. That was real hurt. All right, gnarly. I just felt like I should... Oh dear. 
use that every so often. Let's do it again. Oh, right, this dude. Uh, oh, I died. <laughs> I started aggroing it, and then I was like, okay, I should kill these IDPD, and then I didn't kill those IDPD before they killed me. It was bad. All right. That was still a pretty satisfying loop, considering Rogue is probably the hardest character to do well with. Like, that, that was nice. I liked that. It's a good feeling to do well with her, since she is tricky. Okay. Nice, not nice. Sure, I'll get some ammo for this. Eh, I'd rather just not do what you're having me do right now. But I think that that run did demonstrate the value of Bloodlust with Strong Spirit pretty well, as it does every time I get it. Oh no, I gotta do it. Throne Butt's too fun. Alright. How about you die? How did you live? I'm a little confused. I guess he shot um, his slugger thing that does five damage. And I was just too close to him because I was like, alright, I'm going to kill him before he shoots me. And he shot me and I could, couldn't see it at all. That's probably what happened. Zero visible frames, basically. Why do you guys have to spawn here? Alright, well, they at least paid for the amount of ammo it took to kill them. <laughs> Which is nice of them. Alright. This looks like a nice level. This is a very nice level, in fact. It'd be nice. I'm gonna skip that. I'm just gonna go 100%. Never mind. Oh god, there are two shielders at least. No. No. I hate shielders. Shielders and I are really bad friends. Nice. Definitely. I should take that, but I'm gonna take this instead. Mind you, this is not strats. This is how you get yourself killed. Not that Strong Spirit would have saved me, actually. But Scarier Face probably was more likely to save me from that situation. It's just for later situations, I definitely wanted to have Strong Spirit. Uh, could you not be the biggest scum? The biggest scum. Hot new game show, you know? Alright, there it is. Now I can use the rogue rifle a little more effectively. Every time I hit with a bullet, there's a pretty good chance that it comes back as ammo that I can reuse. That's actually pretty cool. Like I said, it makes, makes the rogue rifle really good. And it's something I wasn't focusing on it. Last run, I dropped it kind of early, surprisingly. Oh, you take three without Scarier Face. That's right, that was really close to me getting killed. No, get out of my way. Hey, okay, there you go. Alright, things are happening. There's stuff officially going on. Oh, I tank a little bit. Tank a little bit more. Don't do that. If I didn't have self-restraint, I would die in that situation anyway. Because I don't have self-restraint. I have it sometimes. But freaking shielders, I hate. I hate you. You are the worst creatures ever.
gosh. Darn it with the screwdriver. All right. All right. Level two. See if we can get something nice. Oh, I walked right into it. There, there are more of you than I thought there were. Okay, let's not die immediately. Yeah, I'd rather have the crossbow. Don't mind me. All right. Gotta go fast. I don't actually have enough ammo to kill this guy. I also don't have enough health to get hit even once, he says. That's, I mean, it's random where he shoots, but I got him shooting at that direction rather than before I got to that, that position and it was bad. Oh well, we had one good run. And that's all that matters, I hope. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.